Hi folks, it's John Neisman from LastChanceAutoStore.com. I'd like to share with you an update on the, one of the vehicles we're working on. It's a 1957 uh, Porsche 356 replica. And um, previously we were showing you where we had replaced the front beam and we had done quite a bit of work and uh, we repaired the tunnel. So basically this is just a quick little update. Um, so I'll basically just shine the light and uh, show you along the front, just kind of a refresher. So everything is basically all new in this front now. We have the new front beam, we have the replacement steering box, we have all new ball joints and tie rod ends, we have new sway bar bushings with the stainless hardware, everything is mounted correctly. Uh, we have the new shocks, you can see the blue shocks here are brand new. And then, um, so everything basically with steering and suspension in the front is now corrected and is like new, so have a much tighter feel. Um, so then once we had that done, in another video we showed you where we replaced uh, quite a large section of the tunnel that was improperly repaired. So now we're essentially just, we've, we've coated this with a two-part epoxy underneath. Um, so we have that done, and then I think the camera can pick it up if it comes this way. You can see the tunnel now has been repaired properly, and it's also undercoated. I think the camera can probably pick it up without too much glare. And then um, what we'll do next is we're going to apply a commercial grade rocker guard to the whole underside. So now you can see where the seams and gaps and all the little repairs were done to the floor incorrectly. Previously we now have done uh, the way it should be. So structurally it's extremely sound and it looks quite nice. So the next thing we're going to do, as I mentioned, we'll do a commercial grade rocker guard on it uh, to protect the hole underneath. And then once that's done, um, then we'll focus on the next thing. Um, with the engine being in the, uh, installed in the engine bay, it's totally rebuilt and tweaked. We have a concern uh, with some clearance issues with the body. So we'll share with that uh, with you in another upcoming video. So just the update, this is the underside of the 57 Porsche 356 replica. I'm John from LastChanceAutoRestore.com.